Well, your voice has gone, Andrea, which probably tells us everything we need to know about that game. It was a, a wild old afternoon. Yes, sorry for my voice, but I lost the voice during the match. <coughs> we are disappointed because when we lose the match in the last 10 seconds, uh, it's very tough. But uh, we played a very good match, a big match. And uh, I'm disappointed for the players because they gave uh, all. And uh, they play with a big heart, with a big soul, big, big quality. And, uh, but this is football. We have to accept the result. We have to change page from tomorrow because we love the sport. And sometimes uh, you can win, sometimes you can lose. But it's important to play always with a, with a big courage, with a big proud. And we are proud about our players. And for large stages of the game, it, it felt like your side were having to absorb a lot of Tottenham pressure. But actually, in those closing stages, you'd worked your way back into the game, hadn't you? Yes, we have our style. We know, we know which is our risk. Tottenham is a very good team to press in, for, in front. Our uh, centre-back, our midfielder. But we, are, we have our style, we want to play. I think in the second half, after the first 10, 15 minutes, we had more space and we created a lot of chances. And uh, we, have, we had uh, our chances, but uh, if we do can score the goal with uh, these uh, big players, uh, the result is always in balance and can happen. We can win or we can lose. And uh, this, this time uh, Tottenham scored the goal, uh, win the game. How was the communication with Roberto today? Because obviously he was trying to get messages to you all on the, the touchline. Did that, did that work well? Because obviously he wasn't in the stadium. Yes, yes. Um, he was always in contact with the bench. He asked it to me about the, the substitution. Okay. It wasn't easy because uh, sometimes when you speak the football, the match go forward and maybe you take uh, one yellow card or uh, I don't know. And uh, it's not easy. But uh, uh, I sp we spoke with Roberto a lot and uh, he suffered with us. But um, we, have to, we have to accept and we have to be proud about our players and our fans. How is he doing? Will he be back for the next game? Roberto. Ah, yes, yes. Uh, Roberto probably uh, from tomorrow is here and uh, he's in Brighton. Sorry, not in London, but he come in England. He stay well. And I want to say for everybody, for all fans, he stay good. He don't have uh, any problem and uh, sure for the next game it is on the bench because for me, I can't stay, <laughs> I lose my voice. I was going to say, you'll be pleased to see him back because you don't want to do any more shouting, right? <laughs> oh, yes, I, I, am, I love my job, but it's better Roberto come. <laughs> you love it too much today, I, I hear it. Yes. Thank you very much. No, welcome, thank you too.